As I understand the anger with a lot of people who are doing the rioting and the looting and the destruction, I don't think it's the right choice. I think it's mostly counterproductive. I mean, yes, it gets people to talk about the subject, but it also makes a lot of people become more prejudiced as a result. Now, I understand that some people, they're like, well, I don't care. They were already going to think of black people that way anyway, so who cares? Let's just watch it all burn. There is a video from Trey Melvin uh, that he switched everything over to his own personal site that's behind a paywall, but you do get a one-week free trial. So I decided to do that and look at his video in regard to the rioting and such. And yeah, it's, uh, it's let's watch the whole thing burn. And from the ashes, they'll, they'll come triumphant. You know, they'll, they'll build a new system. And it's just like, you have no idea what you're going to replace this current system with. You have no plan. Now, there are some people out there who think that we can replace what we currently have, you know, replace capitalism with socialism. But even those people don't seem to be considering all of the misery and starvation and chaos that would occur during the transition. Basic necessities people aren't going to be able to get. You know, there's electricity is out. The food supply chain is out. Uh, gasoline, I mean, I mean, so, I mean, you'll be able to get gas for a while, but then once those pumps are empty, they're empty. You know, how do you get that back? How do you, how do you buy your necessities? How do you trade for your necessities? How many people would die as the result of this transition? You know? Certainly not going to be able to use these. I mean, yeah, you can t take pictures with them, but then what? Put it on your computer that will only run if you actually have electricity and you won't have access to the internet because the internet service providers will be done? What about all the infrastructure for just so many of the things we count on? Done. It's all done. Oh, well, we, we can rebuild it. We can uh, rebuild it with a socialist model. Yeah, and how many years will that take? How many years of misery would we have to put up with? How much, and, and what about hospitals? How will, how will, I mean, and then there's the other problem with, with socialism is, you know, competition breeds innovation. When things are no longer run in a competitive manner, how are we ever going to have anything new or upgraded? You know, should, should people never really look forward to anything new and improved? Oh, just get the bare basic minimum on everything and be satisfied? Because look, you have plenty of quantity of this mediocre stuff. Well, I mean, I guess it's good that it would be available to more people, but how could we ever have anything better? Well, I guess that's not something we should focus on. Let's not try to have anything better. Let's try, let's attempt to remove greed from the equation altogether, right? I don't know. Um, but the transition is the main, is the biggest issue. The other issue is, you know, once we'd have that much chaos for that long during the transition, there's going to be a desire for order again. How, how can we keep the system from becoming authoritarian 
in order to try to restore some sort of order. I think it'd become authoritarian. It'd become, you know, it'd become the, the bad things that have happened to, to other socialist countries or communist countries. The authoritarianism would, would come into full force in order to try to get order. How would you stop that? Oh, well, you know, we'll be different. I am of the mindset that we have a flawed system, but we shouldn't throw the baby out with the bathwater. We should try to make what we have work. And it may take a lot of work to get this to work better for more people. But it is possible. People just have to be fed up enough. But if we're going to just destroy the whole thing, especially if there's no plan on what to replace it with, what kind of crazy shit is that? Anyway, rant over. Thanks for listening. <laughs>